I'm Jerome Derodi. I'm a clinical lecturer here at Medway School of Pharmacy. That's clinical pharmacy that I'm involved in. Pharmacists are involved in frontline healthcare. Uh, fundamentally, they supply medicines, the right medicine at the right dose for the right patient. There are a number of different kinds of pharmacists who work in different situations. There are industrial pharmacists who are largely involved in research. There are hospital pharmacists who are involved on the wards in hospital, uh, providing medicines to patients, again checking that doses are accurate. There are community pharmacists that work out in the community in your standard pharmacy shop. They're the frontline healthcare on the high street. They're primary care pharmacists who advise GPs about the best medicines available and the evidence base behind those so as to ensure best medicine and cost-effective use. And last but not least, there are academic pharmacists like myself who spend most of our time lecturing at universities, but many of us will actually also have an additional role in one of the other fields of pharmacy so that we actually keep in touch with the coalface, with patients and with other healthcare professionals. I completed a bachelor's degree, which was what there was at the time for pharmacy. Nowadays, with more clinical involved, uh, students actually have to undertake a slightly longer master's course in pharmacy. I started off initially as a community pharmacist, went on to be involved in a primary care trust as a prescribing advisor and then as my clinical role developed more and more at one of the inevitable NHS reshuffles I uh, had a role as a public health pharmacist and then eventually turned to academia outright.